Hey guys, what's up? Well, I'll give you guys a look at the my AR, and I got my parts kit in the mail today. This is actually the second item that I received besides the AR. Lower, that is. So we'll start with that. As you can see, 77.45 was total. Um, I did order this about a month ago. It was on back order. They did let me, however, go ahead and get it. They didn't take the money out of the bank right away, which, you know, kind of sucked, but it is what it is. So, I'll show you guys that. Now, I'll, I'll open it up and show you inside. I was going to do a whole thing on how to do, do it, but it's just, it's been done by so many people. So, um, if you look down here, the focus. There we go. Tactical invasions lower. Okay. Yeah, you're right. You're seeing it right. Four hundred fifty bucks. Um. It is what it is. Actually, two weeks prior to me getting this, I was looking at them and they were two hundred dollars from the same place. So. It is what it is. Um, tactical innovations. If you're looking to do an AR, you should really look up the website, check them out, and compare them. Because I'm telling you right now, it this is something else. One thing that is kind of stinks is they do. Let me get this paper out of the way. Alright, they do have special pins, you know, get that out, and this is part of the, the whole thing about this receiver, is this has the STBA, alright, pins look almost like normal pins, but you see that little mushroom, that mushroom, can hardly see it in the bag. I don't know if you can see that very well. But it looks like a nut. Head of a nut. Well, that, let's see if I got the right side, goes down into. See that? These stainless steel inserts. And they are on both sides. Which is a nice feature. I, I've talked to a lot of people and they'll have their triggers start to walk on them. And what it is, is over time, this aluminum will start to kind of get a little out of shape. And just over time, it will start moving on you. Uh, with these, you have the stainless steel inserts. With the pins, I'm gonna order some more of these from Tactical Innovations. I'm not sure how much they are. They're they're pretty inexpensive. You might order about five or six pairs just to have on hand. Another thing with this lower, oh, let me go through in order so I don't miss anything. Let's see. It is made from seven. 7075 T6 aluminum. Okay, so it's the good stuff. The Magwell is wired EDM machined. I don't know if you guys can see that very well, but it is it is silky smooth in there. Very nice finish inside and out. I mean, absolutely beautiful job on it. Let's see what else. Uh, all the markings are laser engraved. Focus. They're, they're very, very clear and very crisp. Make that out. 
but it's done up very nice. Uh, let's see. Another thing that I really thought was cool on it is you'll get some ARs in the upper and the lower. That upper will kind of move a little bit. You need to shake it. It'll jiggle a little bit. That's because it's not meeting up right. You'll have uh, something that's not mil spec to something that is. And what they've installed, look in there, a little green tip on that screw. That screw has an Allen head down inside that hole. And what it's for is so that you can tighten up your upper so it's nice and snug if you have any problems with it. And over time, you know, things happen. You run a gun, bump your gun around and stuff. Well, I thought that was a nice little, little backup to have. So, what it's called is the upper receiver tensioning screw. Which, yeah, you could drill that out, tap it yourself. You could do that without a problem. I don't know if anybody wants to do that, but kind of got to move that around. Let's see, it's about even in there, and then it's right at the edge, kind of right there. I was going to do a whole thing, but so many people have perfectly good videos of it. It's just pointless to keep on adding to it. Um, ooh, your rear detent. Right here. That has a little Allen screw in there. And that's the capture. That's spring and plunger. Which is very nice. Um, and like I said, the finish is just superb absolutely superb so uh and this is i believe it says it on it yeah, it's a multi caliper yeah even let's see if we can pick that up good Mm, two, two, three, five, five, six. So there we go. Tactical innovations upper. Not the low end one either. And their website as of today, it is going for two hundred and seventy-nine ninety-nine. You know, you go to it local place and pick it up it's you're gonna run more and if you have it shipped in you know you're still gonna shipping and everything everybody right now is charging an arm and a leg and even though I paid about five hundred dollars just for this you know you look at gun prices right now if you don't have it and you want it you're gonna have to pay for it so just how it is and just having my AK, you know, I don't see any 545 ammo at Walmart. And that's why I decided to go to this. Um, something that's a little bit easier to get ammo. And I have a few different rounds that I can put down this. So, but that's what we got now. And I'll be sure to keep you guys informed on how it's coming and what she's looking like. Alright guys, peace.